What's up, you guys? I'm Marty of Marty Music. Would you be an angel for a helpless co-writer today? Every day, innocent co-writers are denied their share of a song's revenue because it's just too hard to split payments between multiple writers. And as you can see, they're crying out for help. Please follow the link in the description to sign up for DistroKid. Using the Teams feature, you can automatically route any percentage of earnings from any track to anyone, and your collaborators, producers, bandmates, managers, and more. With plans starting at $19.99 a year, only six cents a day, you can save a defenseless creative collaborator from going without income on your dope tracks. And if you sign up now, you can get 7% off your subscription. That's, well, it's still 7% for the day rate I described earlier because of math. Anyway, sign up now and help a bandmate who deserves a second chance. They now have that chance, thanks to you. Right, so there's just a tiny little a little power chord in that beginning that's the ninth fret D and G before the main riff so just listen out for that but it's ninth fret D and G then we're gonna go to the what I call the main riff it starts on a B power chord so second fret a string root and then there there's a little mute just as part of your rhythm you know, and it goes up to the fifth fret A string power chord. Then you go to the second fret E root power chord, and you're gonna pick, uh, hit it, and slide it up to the fifth fret, like that. So we have another guitar part. So ninth fret D, 11th fret G. Slide it up a minor third to where that index is on the 12. Down to the seven right there. That's going on over the... And that part always ends on that B chord. Separated. All right, now we have the... And so middle finger on the second fret of the A string. Then do the third fret. Then D string first to second slid up to fourth and back.
So now I'll call that the verse, and we're going da 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 da. And so it starts on that B power chord, second fret A root. And you're palm muting underneath that right palm to get that genty sound, shall I say? With this guitar, I, I guess I'm allowed to say that. So, one, two, three, one, oh, two, three, four. And so that second fret slides up to the five, just like in the main riff. Back to the B. Then, it, then on the A string, it goes up to the fifth fret. And then a 2-5 back on the E. Next section, 7th fret A string root. Up to 10th fret, so 7 up to 10. Then 9. Then 7 on the E. Slid up quickly to a 10 on the E. So. So after it does that, uh, back to one piece of the verse. And then ninth fret A string power chord rings out. Then the main riff is also the chorus. Hey! Separated. Separated. There's one other part. All right, when you're playing that chorus on the last one. Boom, separated. Here's the last one. So you've got that regular part of the riff, then you go to the E power chord, 7th fret A, to the 3rd, then just a half step down, you're back on the riff, 2nd fret E, come out and play, shit, like that. So one more time, that last part. There it is. And that is all the parts. So much fun. Rock it out. That's it. All right, hope you guys enjoyed the lesson. Thank you again for your continued support, you guys. Really appreciate it. Also, huge shout out to uh, DistroKid for being a great sponsor. Thank you. Check them out again in the link below. Uh, that's it. We'll hope to see you later.